Halloween Day Story by Anne Rockwell Pictures by Lizzie Rockwell Today is going to be a very exciting day. I'm going to wear my Halloween costume to school. My friends will wear their costumes, too. Wow, look at us! Some of us look scary, and some of us look beautiful, but all of us look great. I wonder where Mrs. Madoff is. I want her to see my costume. Maybe Mr. Sisko will be our teacher all by himself today. I wish Mrs. Madoff could hear me say, Meow, while I swish my long black tail. The fierce pirate with a patch over his eye and the red scar painted on his cheek is really Nicholas. Charlie looks just like the real firefighters who work in the firehouse on Main Street. The witch wearing a tall black hat is Katie. She told me that was what she was going to be. Sarah showed us how cowpokes out west twirl their lares and sing yippee yi o ki -yay. Then Mr. Sisko said it was time for our Halloween parade. A beautiful fairy godmother appeared in the hall. Who could she be? I'll bet the big orange pumpkin is really Pablo. Yes, I'm sure it is. Those look like Pablo's new sneakers. If the big orange pumpkin is really Pablo, then the boy in the gross green monster mask must be Sam. Yes, the pumpkin and the monster are walking together just like Sam and Pablo always do. Evelyn is pretending she's a clown. She can turn somersaults just like the clowns in the circus did. She did one right in front of the library and everyone clapped. Mr. Sisko thought Evan was a robot, but I knew right away he was an astronaut. Jessica is dressed up like Comet Queen on TV. I think that program is scary, but Jessica isn't scared of anything. At snack time, we had a Halloween party. Our fairy godmother waved her magic wand over some orange tissue paper in a big box. She said, Abracadabra, cuppity boo, what do you think I have for you? Suddenly, the box was full of cupcakes, one for each of us. Mr. Sisko gave us candy corn and apple cider, too. I ate my candy corn and drank my cider, but I saved my cupcake for the last because I liked looking at its funny pumpkin face. Guess what? Mrs. Madoff was with us all the time. She was pretending to be our fairy godmother for Halloween. The End